again with your feet wide, one foot on the step, one foot on the floor, and sink into a squat. Extend your arms as you go down, and make sure to keep a slight bend in your elbow when you reach forward. You're going to do all reps on this side, then switch legs and repeat. The trick here is to step back as you punch diagonally forward. You're going to alternate from side to side, 24 reps total. Hold your dumbbells steady as you lift and lower your leg out to the side, tapping between each rep. You're going to do all reps on this side, switch legs, and repeat. The lifts here are very small range, just a couple inches up and down. Keep a slight bend in your elbows and your knee bent at 90 degrees as you lift and lower. Switch legs and repeat. For this move, you want to be sure to sink into that static lunge before you rotate to the side. Come back up, go back into lunge and rotate to the opposite side to complete one rep. You'll do all reps on this leg, then switch legs and repeat. Use your extended leg as a kickstand as you bring your knee up towards your chest and your arms down by sides. You'll do all reps on this leg, then switch sides and repeat. For this side crunch, you're gonna bring elbow and knee together in a semi-tuck position. Do all reps on this side, then switch sides and repeat. The motion of this move is sort of like a half jumping jack. The key here is to keep your toe pointed downwards as you tap the top of the bench. You're going to do all reps on this side, then switch sides and repeat. 